of war provided by the US Empire, which are meant to be used against armed nations, were used by Israel against the armless people of Jenin in an attempt to kill the resistance. Make no mistake, this was a security operation. But this was not one aimed at armed combatants, but at the Palestinian resistance, which threatens the very fabric of Israel. It is not about killing individual revolutionaries, but attempting to kill the revolution itself as Israel aimed to exterminate Janine and its refugee population. The end game was for Palestinians to give up any hope of self-determination and liberation. But Israel has failed for 75 years, and it has failed this Do week we well. demand some further real concrete steps from the Australian government. Yeah. Few of us know that every year the Australian government gives permits for dozens and dozens and dozens of export licenses to export military equipment from Australia to Israel. We should demand that to end. We should demand an absolute boycott of Australian military supplies to the Israeli Defence Force. Because we know they use it on the occupation. We know they use it to kill Palestinians. We know they use it to kill Palestinian kids. And we should demand that end. No continued military engagement between Australia and, the, and Israel. The killing of Palestinians will never be normal. Life under occupation will never be normalised.